I'd like to greet everybody with a universal greetings of peace and the blessings of God be with you. Greet all of my Muslim brothers and sisters all around the world that's uh, honoring uh, Ramadan. I greet you with the universal greetings of Ramadan Mubarak. Also greet you with the universal greetings of I Salam Alaikum Wa Rahmat to Allah Rabakatu. Also say I wouldn't be lad he man ass Satan Irajim Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. I seek refuge with God from Satan, the rejected enemy, the accused, and the accursed devil. In the name of God, most gracious, most merciful. Today is Wednesday, May the 22nd, 2019, the time being about 2.54 uh, p.m. Uh, I made a, a video, a YouTube video, maybe about 20 or 30 minutes ago, and then I titled it, Raymond Lewis Ivy Said, Talk to God in the Prosecuting Attorney for the 33rd Circuit Court. That's here in Charles, Missouri, Mississippi County. And I made that for a reason, and this gonna be part two, is because the fact uh, I done had a few people, even the enemy, trying to approach me once they see themselves in trouble. You see what I'm saying? Uh, I don't have anything to say to anybody that I feel that's a danger and a threat to me and my household. When I have a spirit of discernment to tell me to don't trust somebody, that's what I do. That's why, you know, and then I don't need no mediator. God will tell me who my mediator is. You see what I'm saying? That's why I'm not in the game. You follow what I'm saying? I'm, I'm independent. When I was in Islam, my name was Omar. Omar mean leader, alone living, Hakeem. Hakeem was the wise, and El Mutakabil. El Mutakabil meant the independent one. I followed the Quran. I didn't follow man. You see what I'm saying? I follow God now. You know what I mean? I respect all religions. You see what I'm saying? No matter who they is, no matter what their race is. But one thing that I don't follow, I don't follow corruption. I don't care who it is. I don't, I don't trust certain people in this town. And I want somebody to let the message soak in. You see what I'm saying? On February the 14th, 2019, when Barry Boyce followed me to the Family Dollar here on the corner of Vine and Main, when he approached in my car, I don't know what part of the English that he didn't understand and anybody else didn't understand. I don't have nothing to talk to you about. I'm gonna let the people that I know you fear talk to you. And that's the people up there uptown the white people, the law. I don't have nothing to talk to you about. You see what I'm saying? When all this stuff that you and your friend, the Gail Easton and Antoine uh, Williams, lunatic and all of y'all, those of you all's family and friends that participated in getting on Facebook, calling me a rapist, calling me a child molester, calling me a predator, you see what I'm saying? Calling me a pedophile. None of that's true. None of it at all. You see, the one thing that the picture y'all put up, you see, literally y'all know it's been 19 years, but I've been fighting to get it off of me. And hopefully, maybe one day this week or next week, it will be off. But the things that you all and did to me and my family, let's see if you're going, when you're, pictures be in the newspaper if you're going to post that up. You see what I'm saying? If you're going to post that up, whether you post it up or not, I ain't going to post it up, but I don't trust you. You see what I'm saying? If you just recently uh, uh, telling me uh, that if, if, if I mention your name or your family name, what you going to do, you're going to come in the sheriff's, office, uh, the sheriff's house and get me. 
you're coming to jail to get me. And then they just recently, last week or so, got a gun out of your car. What makes me think, what makes you think that I don't think that that gun that you had in your car, if the sheriff's department didn't get you, that you wouldn't have tried to use it on me. That's why I don't trust you. That's why I told y'all, if you come on this property, what I'm gonna do. You see what I'm saying? Individuals like y'all, you see what I'm saying? Killed my brother, uh, August the 3rd, 1977. Shot him in the back four times and once in the back of the head like cowards. Y'all was acting like cowards. Y'all was acting like a pack of dogs, a pack of dogs running a crowd. You see what I'm saying? So, again, if it ain't God coming to me and telling me to talk to one of these individuals, I don't want none of y'all to come tell me to talk to these individuals. Like I said, I'm not in the game, so can't nobody give me no orders. You see what I'm saying? All I'm asking is, all of those that y'all know that y'all enemies, don't approach me, because when you approach me, I'll feel that you coming to attack me, and if I feel you coming to attack me, I'm going to protect myself. Don't come on my property. If I see you in an establishment, I'm going to leave out. You see what I'm saying? And I'm just letting y'all know one more time. Don't nobody come to me asking me to talk to none of them individuals. None of their families or their friends. Nobody in their circle. You see what I'm saying? Because what nobody there, y'all don't know what my two young daughters been going through. They have to tell a psychologist what these big old cowards been doing to them. You see what I'm saying? But you see, the courts is handling them now. We went to court today. And when we went in there, it was a whole different thing. It wasn't like at the police station. It wasn't like down here. It wasn't like when they ride past here. You see what I'm saying? Have they one buddy put on a wig, a woman's wig, you see what I'm saying? And say things about me uh, uh, doing something to kids, but he got kicked out of the house on one end of vine for trying to mess with a female child, and now he's in the projects. They ain't gonna tell you that. But that's between them and God. Now, I'm really not beginning to trust too many of anybody here because Anybody that know me know I don't want to have nothing to do with these guys. These guys are not only slandered my name, but these same guys put fear in my daughters. They made my daughters and them see that people laying here asking my daughters and them is what these guys saying true about their dad. And my daughters and them had to tell them no. You see, what they did to me, it'll come back on, it's coming back on them now, but it'll come back on their families too. You see what I'm saying? So don't come to me asking me nothing about any one of them guys, like I said before. If Fairy Boys was here, laying here, dying, and I can save them, the girl, now we put Lunatic in the middle since he won't have wear a wig, a woman wig. Lunatic in the middle. And Nigel Easton right here, uh, Antoine Williams in the middle, lunatic, and they was dying in the Grand Wizard. He could have just been done home. Seven or eight black people. I'll let these Negroes die and save him. Long as you get to hanging Negro, Negroes like this here. That's what I feel about them, and I don't care who don't say, who don't like what I'm saying. You see what I'm saying? I didn't like what these Negroes did. My daughters and them didn't like it. My families and them didn't like it. You see what I'm saying? You reap what you sow and that's what y'all reaping. I seen you in the courtroom. You see what I'm saying? Your pants wasn't sagging then. Yes sir, the judge they told you to take your butt over to the sheriff's department to get your fingerprints. You didn't tell them you wasn't going to do that because you scared of them white folks and you scared of the law enforcement. And that's what I'm going to put on you because your parents should have put that rod on your behind when you was young. You see what I'm saying? Y'all kept on talking about you want me to come out of retirement. That's what you wanted. But see, I got something to lose. Y'all ain't got nothing to lose. I love my children and my daddy. That's why I don't be out in these streets. Acting a fool like y'all. The sergeant of the police department, even though he's a fool, he told you what you was out here doing. Acting a fool. You see, but y'all gonna act a fool with the wrong person? 
You see what I'm saying? And you ain't gonna make it to court. That wrong person gonna give you what you're looking for. You see what I'm saying? It must be something that you got to ride around with a gun now, but you didn't have no gun. You, 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 you coming at me, talking about jumping on me, talking about whooping me, talking about running me out of town, talking about coming in the sheriff's office doing something to me, but why you got to go get a gun for whoever you got the gun for? Why didn't y'all go to their house and do the same thing? You know why? Because you bullies, you cowards, you snakes, and you rats. Peace be still.